I was a senior in high school at the time, and I was sitting in our theater class, and Justin comes in, he was a freshman then, and he says, you want to be in a movie? And I'm like, hey, can you, uh, would you be interested in this? And I'm just like super nervous because it's just like, that guy went to state. I said, yeah, sure. I, uh, my mind heard movie, and I said, yes. The Hero Unknown was my first movie. You know, I do the scene where I punch Paul, and he gets up, and I say, come on, bring it on. And Paul went to hit me, hit me, and he slipped in the grass, and he nailed me right in, right in the, it was this side, actually. And then we did the movie, uh, then kind of got to know him. So after graduation, uh, we, would, we would talk on Facebook. We didn't see each other a whole lot. It just kind of went up and down occasionally. But we'd talk on Facebook, and I'd look for opportunities to share my faith with, faith with him. For the longest time as being a director, I thought I had to be opinionated, um, very o almost over, overly strong-minded. So I'd get the opportunity, but, you know... I kind of stepped back for a little bit, realizing that I think it was just a little much. He asked me to be in another movie with him. And so I said, okay, it had been uh, three years at the time since I'd done a movie with him. Myself and the girl I acted with in the movie, we all three of us got together at coffee shop and we just kind of talked about what we wanted to do. He asked me what job I would want to play in a movie. I said, I've always liked thinking about playing a teacher. And I told him I kind of wanted to add some spiritual themes into the movie, and he liked that idea. He liked being able, he wanted to show a movie that kind of gave good light to Christians, just kind of show what it's kind of like every in everyday life. Even though he didn't believe in Christianity at the time. The name of that movie is Offbeat. They are online. I believe they're on his YouTube channel. And then he uh, invited me to youth group in church. I was here at church and Pastor Al uh, uh, was talking in his sermon about asking people to church. And I got more involved with that, but um, life happened. If I went and explored it with having not a clear mind, not having a, a strong mind, then I might just get completely turned off. Things just happened. He wasn't able to come very much anymore. And so I invited him to Alpha. I said, this is a really cool thing. Um, it, I gave him the flyer and he, I said, it's just an opportunity where you can come and ask your questions without really getting a sermon from people, without just being expected to listen and not ask questions. And so... He said that'd be really cool, and he showed up. I'm someone that has the general ideas down. There was comfort with an alpha that that was okay. Pretty much almost every other place there would be like people would say, hold on a second, that's not, that's not good enough, that's not productive, but alpha was productive. Alpha is a good experience that even if you aren't Christian, you can um, still bring up your beliefs, your ideas into discussion. If you were wanting to study uh, world religions, this would be the best situation to explore Christianity.